Are you a content creator? Do you have a YouTube channel? Want to monetize, promote, and protect your channel from intellectual property theft? At a forever, we will monetize, optimize, and protect your channel, helping you earn better. We also offer you professional content management support guidance. Join our network today and enjoy our premium benefits. Contact us at mcnataforever.com. Walking out 
and the faculty, a charter, a never do well. How did the awards go? Man, you can't believe it. Bring it on. That guy, Eric, uh -huh. he came out as the overall best student of the semester. Ho -ho! <laughs> and the other guy, Rufus, uh -huh. came out as the second best. The tall guy? Yes. What a coincidence. You Two of that. the guys that we've been watching for a while now. Ooh, time to work on something. Frank, hmm? it's time. We have to get them on board. Especially that guy, Eric. Okay. He will serve as a good mercenary for our brothers here who are having academic problems. And for our other brothers in other schools. Absolutely. You're right on that, Frank. You're right. You see, I'll uh, see Festus this evening. Right. We must make sure uh, that they attend the next initiation. We must. We'll work on that. You're right. Say so we'll see you in the evening and we'll okay. catch up on a few things. Okay. Good. You take care. Keep it real. All right. Watch your back. Yeah. Actually, coming to your office before we met you here. Yes, I sent for you. I must congratulate you for making the department number one in the faculty. Thank you, sir. Uh, but however, there is some bad news. Bad news, sir. What's happened? I just received a memo from the registrar that the award could be withdrawn unless you have clearance from the bus train. Sir, what do they mean by that? I'm talking about the unpaid school fees since your second year, Eric. And uh, Rufus, you've paid some, but you still have a backlog of uh, one session. Sir, I promise I'll pay as soon as I... You see, Eric, you don't have to promise me anything. This is not about me. It's about the decision of the school authority. Sir, I would have paid this fee since last semester. But they stopped the student's loan scheme and it made things a whole... You see, the student's loan scheme is supposed to be support to your finances, not a source of funding it. <laughs> Sir, with or without the student loan scheme, I promise I'll pay mine before the end of the semester. I'll pay it. You both don't understand me. I've been instructed to inform both of you that if you don't pay up this fees by the end of the semester, you will not be allowed to take the second semester of the exams. Sir. And you know what that means. Please, help us, sir. Please, just... Sorry, young man, this is beyond me. Good day, gentlemen. you all the chicks in the faculty will now be falling head over heels for you. Especially all those young angels from the department. You know that kind of thing. Hey, congratulations. Young I'm bro. happy for you, man. 
the correct man, you're too you. much, you know. You don't look happy. It's anything the problem? I've been asked to leave the school at the end of the semester. You're kidding. The best student in the faculty to leave the school. For what now? It's a long story. Is it about the school fees? I thought you paid your fees. No. Family problems. You know, after my father died, things have not been the same. I, I thought you should have relatives. I mean, your mom can reach on your behalf. They all concluded after my father's death that I should withdraw from school and go and learn a trade. I chose to come back to school of my own volition. I mean, they ought to be proud to pay you through school. I mean, you're the envy of all students. You know now. As far as they are concerned, I am learning a trade. Only my mother and I know I am in school. Wow. That sounds real, real tough. So, what's, what's your next plan now? I don't know. I don't bloody know. Man, don't let this thing to weigh you down. Come on, be yourself. Drink the go fields. We all just just cause more confusion. Join. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> See, Sela, it's just a drink like winch. Am I way now? Sela, Sela. What in the water, you guys? You come out. Only woman I said. Junior, junior. Chasing for the past two semesters, hanging out with that guy. And that's your sweetheart. That's her. Maybe the guy is a uh, classmate. Rubbish. That guy is a wolf. Junior, what is Cynthia doing with the wolf? Answer me. That guy is a wolf. Of course, he's a wolf. You know it. I see. So. That is her game. No wonder each time I go to see her, she's always giving me cold shoulders. Expecting me to give her heaven and earth, as if she were a prostitute. She's not my problem. What bothers me is these guys called wolves. They drive around in big cars, you know, dressed in expensive suit, as if they were some kind of a bank executives or something. That is it. At the end of the day, Every girl on campus will spend all guys to do the same. Exactly. What does this guy want? He has a girlfriend, yet he keeps carrying Sylvie around. <laughs> Junior, don't you understand? I mean, you don't get it. That's a calculated attempt to block your chances of getting that girl. Oh, look at this guy. <laughs> You go sell that with him. Make him realize you're interested in Cynthia. So he should back off. What are you talking about? You mean the black scorpions will not go and beg or take permission? No way. Ah, no, 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 no. From the walls before hanging out with girls on campus. Mm. You know what, guys? I'm going in there right now. <laughs> Hello, Cynthia. Hi. Can I speak to you privately for a moment? Well, as you can see, I'm with my friends. I know. That was why I said privately. Perhaps some other time. Not in the mood for any private discussion. Cynthia, I came all the way just to see you. Can't you just... She said she's busy. Ah, shh! Shh! 
shut your damn trap and mind your business. I was not talking to you. Well, well, Mr. Man. Why can't you relax? We are not fighting you, are we? Then I suggest you advise the lady to come with me. It is a request. We shall stay with you some other time. She either comes with me or she will not leave this place with you. Say it to Say it to You just watch me. Cynthia, I need to talk to you. Come with me. Hey! Get your hands off me! I don't even know you! Why are you embarrassing me? Please! Young man. I hope you've not come here to embarrass me. I said leave. I should leave? I can leave! I'm 
What is going on here? Are you aware that by this procession you are disturbing the peace on campus? We are only mourning the death of a dear friend and a brother. I strongly advise that you take this elsewhere. Why? Is there a law that says students cannot fall in the fall of their fellow students? Embarking on any form of demonstration or procession without police permission is illegal. The idiot that murdered our friend did not obtain permission from the police. May I remind you that secret court and other clandestine activities on campus remains a prohibition and I am sure you know it. Secret court, you said? I do not see any secret court activities here. We are demonstrating to students the evil court activities can bring and sending a message to that fellow that murdered a friend to desist from evil. We'll be watching. I assure you, we will be watching. But let me warn you for the last time. The earlier you put a stop to this, the better for all of you. Everybody want to be like the world say. Everybody want to be like the world say. Oh, the world, the world say. The world, the world, the world say. The world, the world say. Everybody want to be like the world say. Everybody want to be like the world say. Everybody want to be like the world say. Ground level, sir. I don't understand. I want to know what happened. You mean in school? <laughs> well, the wolves mourn their dead friend. That is not what I asked. I want you guys to tell me who ordered the heat. Ogapo, much respect. You have no idea. That is a lie, Pascal. It couldn't have happened behind you, my executioner. You, my pilot, my point man, and even you, my tracker. You guys should tell me who ordered the hit. Kapu, how should we know? Pascal just told you. I mean, we did not do it. But all accusing fingers point at the glass copion as the culprits. That is nonsense. Absolutely nonsense. There are about six groups on this campus. So he could have been any one of the other groups. Yes. But there was a friction between us and the wolves. Kapoor. 
that guy is dead. And that is it. I see no reason why we should lose our sleep over that. Oh, oh, oh. I think I, I, uh, those guys are getting too much. And if they are not satisfied, they will do their worst. Jera! I don't like being drawn into unnecessary battles. When I am, I want to be ready for it. I am giving you guys seven days, one week to tell me who or that they hate. Because if I should find out myself, sorry for the person and his accessories. Good day. What 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 is wrong with you? Nicholas. Frank. Yep. Contact our brothers from the Southern University. We must pin Charles down to hand over the food that killed James to us. But we already know who the culprit is. Yes, I know. We must bring the scorpions to total submission. Bring them to their nails. They must hand over the culprit themselves with their own hands. That way, all their people will accept our supremacy. Yeah. From which school do I bring them? Any school. Provide all the logistics and intelligence support. Remember, it must be this week. That's the report to make the council. Is that clear? clear. But why are we here? What's happening? We ask too much questions. have a message to deliver and it must be delivered
in the interest of everyone. Please take the pills. Listen, you have absolutely nothing to be afraid of. Okay? It's just a drop and a gulp. We all go home happily. Come on, take it. So he sent you guys here to give me the pills I can take and I bought his baby? What kind of a man is he? Are you going to take the pills or not? I can't take any pills, please. I'll take it from you. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Just let me shut up! Nick, also down the throat! Swat secrecy. No one must hear what happened here. No one. I cannot do this. I don't have a hand in this. We must all go to the police and report this. Eric, are you insane? This is in house and it stays with us. Not with me. Not with me. We must report this to the police. I reject this. Eric, listen to me. We are all brothers. We are all one. At times like this, we must act like one and support each other. I cannot support you, Nicholas. You just murdered a girl. You called blood. You just struggled. You... Hey, Nicholas, Nicholas, come back. Come back. What are we going to do now? Do we stay? Or we walk? Let's, let, let's get out of here. just murdered has parents. That girl has sisters. How would you feel if they told you your sister has murdered, struggled to death? Rufus. 
give us some vibes. You disappoint me, Eric. No. You disappoint me. You lied to me. You never told me this was all about murdering people. <laughs> Eric. Listen, Eric. I, I understand how you feel. Believe me, I do. It was like that with me and several other new initiates at the time. Don't worry. Hmm? Soon, you will begin to understand. Okay? I want out, Nicholas. I have seen enough bloodshed. I want out. You want out? After all we've done for you, I don't care! I don't care! I freaking care! I want out! I want out! Fine. It's okay. Have a nice day. Roof! I'm out! some form of explanation here. Uh, uh, this is yours, Mr. Eric. Beautiful. I swear to you, sir, I don't know how those things got into the into my room. We got this in your room. And you want us to believe you have no idea how the properties of a girl, your mother, got into your room. Mother, I'm sorry, I swear, Mr. I don't know. Eric, you are under arrest. You are under arrest for the murder of Lucy Agunta. Officer, officer, I, I, I did not do anything. I, I will advise you to remain quiet because whatever you say now will certainly be used against you in the court of law. Samson? Sir. Take him away. Thank you, sir. Now, let's go.
Nicholas, I don't want this to go out. I don't want another ear to hear this. Not even members of the wolves. Hmm? Well, sir, it's clean and clear. I assure you of utmost secrecy. As we speak, Eric is on the police net with Lucy's death well planted on his head. He should be totally denied. He should be totally denied. No connection ever existed between us. As a matter of fact, he ceases to be a member of the wolves. Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. Have a nice day, sir. Someone set me up. By who? Nicholas and the rest of the gang. <laughs> you can't be serious. You're out of your mind. I'm telling you the truth, man. You know what? I saw Nicholas, Sly, and Frank strangle a girl. <laughs> Listen, Eric. I know you're under stress and you've been seeing things, okay? Hmm? I guess you need some rest. No! I'm not seeing things. I did Just today, the policeman came over to the house. They recovered the properties of the girl in my room. You don't mean it. I mean, who did you give the keys to? Yes, I gave the keys to Frank and Slark. I knew it. I knew it. They filled me up. Those, those guys filled me up. You know what? You know what? Since it's like this, eh, I wouldn't want anybody to see the both of us together. Go down to McDonald's and wait for me, okay? I'll meet you up there and we'll go and see the faculty officer together, okay? Okay. Okay. Just okay. go down there. I'll be waiting for I wouldn't you. want anybody to see the both of us, okay? I'll Just go down. Just go down, okay? All right, all right. Go, 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 go. Please, I'll be waiting. No, no problem. Go. Be fast. Nicholas, the guy is at the McDonald's now. Yes. He'll be there in the next five minutes. So get the police. assignment and you 
You played me like a fool. Sir, I, I don't understand. Oh, of course. Of course, there are so many things that you have chosen not to understand, Nicholas. For instance, you let Eric walk free in the campus. It can't be. It's, it's impossible, sir. I mean, I personally arranged for the police to arrest him, and they did. Did you see the police handcuff him and take him away? Did you? Answer me. Did you see the police handcuff him and take him away? No, of course. But, sir, the, the police... I don't want excuses, young man. You brought this shame upon me. And you alone must clean it up. Get out. You listen. Get Eric and hand him over to the police. I don't care how you do it. Or better still, kill him. Do I make myself clear? Get this nightmare away from me. Take it away from me. Yes, sir. Oh, Get out! You just set me up, Rufus. Hmm? Erica was just carrying out orders. Shut up! It was you that gave them access to plant those things under my bed, wasn't it? Eric, have you ever heard of the saying, if you can't beat them, you join them? You can't beat them. What are you talking about? Do you realize the girl they murdered was pregnant? That she only had eight months to graduate? Of us. Don't you have a conscience? Huh? Eric, you should be worried about yourself, not me. All you need to do is come back to the family, plead for forgiveness, and everything will come back to you. Never! No! Never! You and I are going to the police. You will tell them the truth and set me free. And who's going to make me do that? You? Rufus, don't you dare me! Don't you dare me, Rufus, because I swear I'm going to split your skull! Stand up! Move! Move! Eric, you can force a horse to the street. You can never force it to drink water. Shut up! Move! Eric, how far do you think you can go with this whole drama you're putting up? What? Let me lace up my shoes. search and locate the place. Sir, I've gone to all the places I know he usually hangs out and nobody seems to have any information about his whereabouts. Nobody. Nicholas? Sir, there are two class tests coming up tomorrow in his department. I am certain that he will come. Very good. Eric doesn't miss class tests. He doesn't miss sir. Very, very good. Hello? Hello, sir. I I it's me, Eric. Sir, I need to talk to you. It's really important. Eric! I have been trying to reach you all along. The police came to my office. Sir, I've been set up. It's Nicholas. He killed the, the girl in your quarters. 
What? Now, wait a minute, wait a minute. Are you saying that after giving them the privilege to use my quarters, they kill the girl there and put it on you? Exactly, sir. In fact, sir, the police right now, they are after me. Sir, I don't know what to do. Can you come right down to my office, Eric? Uh, uh, no, sir, I can't. The police are looking for me everywhere. Even Nicholas as well. You don't have to worry about that, okay? They won't know you are here. You just come. I know a very good lawyer. And I assure you everything will be fine, okay? Sir, it's a frame-up. You must realize that. I didn't kill the girl. Eric, Eric, I do believe you. I sincerely believe you, okay? By the way, I hear your class has two tests tomorrow. And you must come to do your test. And I will set up the necessary machinery to deal with those rascals. Nicholas and... Uh, what's the name of the other chap again? And Frank! Aha, uh -huh, Frank, okay? And um, I will wait off the police and whoever of you, okay? <laughs> sir, you must help me. You must help me, sir. I don't know what to do, sir. I am innocent. Ah, um, Eric, that's all right. You just come down and do your test. And um, besides that, you should know that your education is of utmost importance. So after that, we can sort everything out, okay? Okay, sir. Okay, sir. I'll be there. Thank you, sir. All right. Bye-bye. tomorrow. So I want you to ambush him and eliminate him on his way to the class. Do I make myself clear? All clear, sir. No mistakes. You may leave. Hello. Okay, um, please. I need you to help me deliver this letter to the HOD. Why don't you do it yourself? I can't. Um, you know, let's just say, man, I, get, I have a problem with the man, okay? And I don't want him to see me. Look, Eric, if it is all about this, your call to Wahala, me, I don't want to get myself involved. Come on, Francis, who's talking about court? I've told you. Please, okay, this is really important to me. No, I don't think so. I think what should be more important to you is for you to take your studies more serious. For God's sakes, you've been busting your lectures like you don't have business with school anymore. What is your problem? For your information, we have two class tests today. Eric, I warned you. I've warned you several times. Joining this your court activities is going to get into trouble. I told you. Now that glitters is not good. I don't know how else to wake you up from this your nightmare. Okay, okay thank you. I, I understand what you guys are saying. But please, please, could you please help me deliver this letter to the HOD? Please. problems every day.
Can I help you? Um, sir, Eric said I should give this to you. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. just read a letter from Eric. He says that someone was murdered at your quarters and that he's been framed up for it. You see, that boy Eric is a criminal. The police said the girl was robbed and in the process of the robbery, she got killed. Someone identified Eric and went to the police. And during the search of his house, items belonging to the girl were recovered. I don't know why that boy Eric is bent on smearing my image with his cock and bull story. What nonsense is this? But sir, uh, I, I wonder how my student could get involved in such a crime and nobody cared to tell me. Oh well, because no one believed his story. And besides, it happened outside the school campus. I don't see how we get involved. It is a criminal offense. So, let him sort himself out with the police. But Eric's letter said it happened at your quarters and that he watched Nicholas, Frank and Sly strangle the girl. Oh, come on, Dr. Ben. It's all lies. I want to assure you that um, the police conducted the investigation and have cleared me of any complicity. In any case, in due time, the truth will certainly come out. That's all I can say for now. So, sir, meanwhile, what are we going to do? Oh, nothing. Oh yes, nothing. Like I said, it happened outside the school area. It is not an academic issue. And so, we don't get involved. It's, it's simple and clear. We know the school rules. All right. Uh, just in case um, you get some information on this matter, let me know. All right, sir. All right. me up when I don't have anything to back up my story for God's sakes you have to convince Nicholas to let you off the hook or oh, isn't he your friend anymore Nicholas wants me dead they don't see me as one of them anymore in that case you have to keep running mm -hmm. run and run away completely I can't do that I can't just just as my academics I mean to become a fugitive for life for God's sakes, your life is what's on the line here. Doesn't that bother you? Listen, I'm going to go to that class and write my test. Later, I'll go to the HUD and the, and the faculty officer. Probably they will help me out. And what makes you think they were going to help you? Look, 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 look that, that, that doesn't matter, okay? You just let me go check around the departmental area, okay? Please, if you see Nicholas or any suspicious moves, 
Please come and tell me, okay? Listen, listen, listen. Me, I'll be at um, behind your seat. Alright. Thanks. Um, I hope nobody has said anything that will implicate him or her. Yes, sir. Such as that running. If I catch you, of course you know what that means. So you have all the time on earth to do that now. Look around you. If there's any foreign material, remove it. Yes, yes, yes. My friend, what is it? Please, sir. My bladder is burst. I want to plan. You, you have just two minutes to do that or forget this test. All right? So, those at the back, I hope you can see the board, board clearly. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You have to answer both questions. The time now is 11.30 a.m. You may start. What you told me about is in the class right now, taking the test. Oh. Please, um, I want you to keep an eye on him. Okay. It is very important. And thank you very much. It's all right. Okay. Inspector Wesley. Yes, the boy you are looking for is in the classroom right now, and writing his test. Oh yes, as arranged. Of course, why not? You can come right away and pick him up. Okay. All right. A test? I'm Don't you realize you're in a class? Huh? Uh, sir, can I have a pen outside, please? Now, quickly go outside and do that fast. I don't want any cooperation, please. 
mind their own paper. Someone gave the police a tip off and they came after me right in the middle of my class test. Who did that? I don't know! And so? I was hoping I could just cool down here for some time. <laughs> Eric, no, you don't have to stay here. This is not the right, the right place for you to come and hide. Oh, Francis, mm. come, Francis, come on. J just till this situation dies down, please. Yeah, you have to go. The police will search for you everywhere they know you could possibly hide. Come please, on, Francis. Francis, Francis, please. Please, man, Francis, I need your help. I don't know what to do. I don't even know where to go. Please, man, you're my friend. Friend. Francis, please. My life is in danger. I need your help. Please help me out. The only thing I can do for you is to take you to your cousin's place. Maybe talk her into allowing you to stay at her place. Maybe till nightfall. As for staying in my place, as for staying here, Eric, no. Fine, no can't. problem. No problem. I, I'm okay. I'm okay with that. Please, can we go okay. now? Just hold on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm grateful. And I want you to stay here. Understand. My folks are coming into town, and I only want them to know that anybody is squatting with me. Please. Let me see you outside for a moment. That's my Here to leave me. It's just till this evening, and I'll come and pick him up. But Francis, you know he's a member of the Wolves, and my boyfriend is a black scorpion. You know it. Carol, you're doing this for me, not for him. Whatever problem he's into, I don't want to be involved. I don't want to. No one will know that he's here now. Please. Okay. But I won't do this another time. You know my girlfriend is a black scorpion. Do you want him to think I'm a traitor? Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. 
It's okay. Okay, fine, okay, fine. Okay, fine. Oh. His friend and former roommates took him into precious hostel off campus. Yeah, he's still in there right now. Okay, I'm watching over the house. No problem, no problem. Hostel. What a shame, man. Please, I have nothing to do with this. Please take him and let me be, please. Shut up. How dare you harbor him? Nicholas, please, let her be. She has nothing to do with us, please. Really? Well, I, I believe in hear no evil, see no evil, and tell no tale. And to achieve that, she must get down with you. <laughs> Quiet! a dissident, be kind enough not to shed the blood of a fellow wolf in a woman's room. We'll take him to Fantasy Island and we'll waste him there. Okay? Hmm. No, sir. This one, the whole company is virtually empty. Are you sure your girlfriend Carola will be in her room at this time of the day? Why not? When is it usually her lecture free day? She must be in. Ah, uh, but well, she's supposed to. But has to be so. Guy man, near the edge. You two be hungry. You two be hungry, say. Supposed to understand that. Hey, guy man. Now move. Out, or I blow your brains out. Move. Yeah, look away. Sign your death warrant. Shut up. I want to know why you killed those people. Why did you murder them? <laughs> you want to know why? Yes! I want to know why. Fine. I'll tell you why. Philip disobeyed the Brotherhood. So he died. Junior and Pascal killed James. And nobody sheds the blood of a wolf and stays alive. Do you get that? And the girl? 
she was innocent. No, she wasn't. She was guilty of trying to blackmail a blood brother. Well, she took him for the faculty officer. He didn't want the pregnancy. So he asked her to abort it. She refused. Yeah, we're just trying to force abortion pills on the girl. In the process, things got complicated. She suffocated and died. I lie! That's a lie! I saw when you strangled her. I saw you like lies! You strangled the girl! You killed her. Eric. Eric, believe what you like, okay? I don't care. Too bad her death is hung all round your neck. <laughs> Oh. So the faculty officer has been the devil himself, huh? Eric. Let me. No. Eric, you have eyes, but you can't see. Call the police. Stay down! No, I said, all of you, no! Quick, why did you call me, Eric? What's the name of this? How did you men get in here? Huh? Get down or out! Break this one! The splash What's of the middle of this? Hey, this is trespassing, okay? okay? You're trespassing. I want to speak to my lawyer. Shut up! Shut up! Yo. Uh, okay. Sir. Um, get quiet! I'm off! Eric, I swear to God, if I get out of this, you're going to Yeah, go to jail first! Yeah. Talk in jail! Exactly, do you mean for what? You're under arrest. You are under arrest for the murder of one Miss Lucy Agunta. I I don't get what you mean. Because I have been perhaps I should inform you that I have been cleared of any complicity in this matter. I am a responsible civil servant and also a senior member of the non-academic union of this institution. Lies! I deserve some respect. All lies! You are merely a wolf in a sheep's clothing. And I think that society can do without elements like you who take advantage of official cover to perpetrate evil. No, Samson! No, I, 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 I want to get my lawyer. I must talk to my lawyer, please. I want to, I, I want to call my lawyer, please. Do not resist arrest, please. I want to call my lawyer. You want to address something before the whole student in the middle of 